Good evening. Welcome to Maryville University and to the Celebration of Excellence for the Johnny e. Simon School of Business. It is my distinct honor and privilege to serve as the Dean of the Simon School of Business and to work with an outstanding group of faculty in the education of our students. We certainly wish tonight's event could take place in person, but please know that our virtual celebration does not diminish our pride in your accomplishments in any way. This evening's ceremony is being streamed live on Zoom. It is also being recorded for later viewing. The link to the entire video will be posted as soon as possible after the event. We hope that you will share the link with your family members and on your social media sites. If you're posting on Twitter or Instagram, please use our hashtag BizExcellence21, B-I-Z, Excellence21. I am pleased to welcome those of you who took your courses online to our campus auditorium. This is the space on campus where we share some of the most special and coveted moments, and it is fittingly the site for tonight's celebration as well. To all of you, we congratulate you on your wonderful achievements, and to our graduates, we congratulate you on the successful completion of your studies. We know that earning a college degree, and especially a graduate degree, is no small feat while you are working, raising your family, maintaining your relationships, and making sacrifices to pay for it all. While you are celebrating tonight and over the next few weeks, I invite all of our graduates to thank their family and friends whose support and understanding have been instrumental in helping you achieve this important milestone. We are pleased you chose Maryville University for this leg of your educational journey. We hope that as additional credentials or your, the refreshing of your skills are needed, that you will look to your alma mater to continue to support your ongoing education and professional development. We are proud to be celebrating wish, with you, and we wish you the very best in all of your future endeavors. We would like to begin the celebratory portion of this evening's program with the induction ceremony for our new Delta Mu Delta initiates. It is my honor to welcome to the podium Ms. Crystal Jacobsmeyer to share the history of Delta Mu Delta. I will then read the names of all of our initiates, and then Dr. Summer Anderson, faculty advisor to Delta Mu Delta, will lead our initiates in the Delta Mu Delta pledge. Crystal. Good evening. Delta Mu Delta was founded on November 18, 1913. Five professors from Harvard, Yale, and New York University believe that exceptional students in the field of business should be recognized and rewarded. They founded our society to provide recognition similar to that given by Phi Beta Kappa in the field of liberal arts. Delta Mu Delta incorporated in 1952 and in 1963 was admitted to membership in the Association of Collegiate Honor Societies. In 1992, the Delta Mu Delta established an affiliation with the Accreditation Council for Business Schools and Programs that requires a school of program be ACBSP accredited to be eligible to have a chapter. The purposes of Delta Mu Delta are to promote higher scholarship in business education and to recognize and reward scholastic attainment in business subjects. Delta Mu Delta membership provides recognition of excellence for a lifetime. As the highest recognition a business, business student can earn, it is appropriate to include Delta Mu Delta membership on one's resume. I am proud to introduce the 2021 initiates to the Kappa Theta chapter of Delta Mu Delta. As your name is called, you will be spotlighted on Zoom, so offer a wave so your friends and family can acknowledge you. 
Camille Samantha Abel. Haley H. Akihiro. Huron Anthony Amara Singer. Supriya Bhatia. James L. Braley. Nicholas Edward Brammeyer. Brandy Irene Branca. Benjamin Brody. Michelle Jean Kaufman. Michael Colbert. Keith Marvell Collins. Sarah Christine Fleming. Victoria Paige Gadke. Samuel Aaron Gendoff. Anna Y. Nieto Hernandez. Jeremiah W. Hinnan. Haley Lauren Hooper. Ashley Sloan Karth. Francesca Maria Colisa. Matthew Alexander Coleman. Arturo Ruiz Lopez. Maya Renee Lucas. Cora Renee Nears. Margaret E. Novak. Virat P. Parikh. Timothy M. Parkin. Muhammad Hafizur Rahman. Oh, and little people. Yay. <laughs> Andrew Clifton Rhodes. Morgan Bailey Ripper. Jill Shinsky. Connor J. Simmons. Andrew L. Scornia. Cassidy Jessica Smith. More little people. Yay. Darren Stam. Jonathan Bradley Steedham. Deborah A. Tully. Rodney Weekly. Jacqueline Widows. Colton James Woodson. And Benjamin Patrick Yilim Pan. I now invite Dr. Anderson to the podium to lead our new initiates in the Delta Mu Delta Induction Pledge. Good evening. 
As the faculty advisor to the Maryville University Kappa Theta chapter of Delta Mu Delta, I am pleased to welcome you into this honor society. Your scholastic qualifications for membership in Delta Mu Delta have been verified by the Dean of the School of Business. You have been honored with an invitation to membership in Delta Mu Delta, and we are, therefore, authorized to induct you as members of Kappa Theta chapter. The faculty of the Johnny e. Simon School of Business at Maryville University present 41 candidates for membership in Delta Mu Delta. Students, the new initiates pledge is displayed on the screen and we will read it together. I solemnly affirm to all those present and those who have preceded me that I will serve the society to the best of my ability. I will observe the society's bylaws and provide counsel and aid for my fellow members. In accepting membership into Delta Mu Delta International Honor Society in Business Administration, I acknowledge the distinct honor that has been bestowed upon me. This pledge is evidence of my commitment to your fellowship. In recognition of your academic achievements and your pledge to the purpose of Delta Mu Delta, you will be receiving in the mail a certificate of membership honor cords, and the key of the society, which provide tangible symbols of your achievement and commitment. Congratulations to all our initiates. This dance is very well orchestrated. Each year, the faculty members of the John E. Simon School of Business review the contributions and accomplishments of our students to select our most outstanding students in each academic program for both undergraduate and graduate students. We also select outstanding students for a number of other school-wide awards. I will invite my faculty colleagues to come forward to first present our excellence awards to our undergraduate students in each program, and then our outstanding graduate students um, in each program. As your name is called, and your award and your name are called, you will be spotlighted on Zoom as we share a bit of information about you. So wave to your friends and family as you are being celebrated. Plaques will be mailed to the address you provided in the RSVP link when they are made. I have several awards to present this evening. The first award is for excellence in accounting and accounting information systems. This award is presented to Tommy Kuok Guien. During his time at Maryville, Tommy served as vice president of the Maryville Accounting Association. His favorite classes were financial accounting and his university seminar, Game On. After graduation, he is moving to Kansas City to work at Deloitte. Congratulations, Tommy. The next award is for excellence in financial services. This is presented to Gino Dodd. Gino has enjoyed his time at Maryville and credits his role on the swim team with improving his time management and allowing him to make many friends. He has appreciated his internship at Northwestern Mutual and will take a job with them or New York Life as a financial advisor while he completes the final year of his MBA. Congratulations, Gino. This year, we have co-recipients of the Mark Roman Emerging Scholar Award. Our first recipient is Gabrielle A. Leonard. During her career at Maryville, Gabrielle has served as the treasurer of the Maryville Accounting Association and treasurer of Abolish Barriers Through Leadership and Empowerment. She was also a PWC Start Intern in 2020. After graduation, she plans to earn her CPA license, complete her master's degree, and work at her dream job at PricewaterhouseCoopers. Congratulations, Gabrielle. The co-recipient of the Mark Roman Emerging Accounting Scholar is Connor Robert Morgenthaler. Connor cites the opportunity to engage in challenging group projects and learn from a breadth of professors and guest speakers as integral to his academic and personal growth. He has been instrumental in the Student Veteran Organization, enabling positive change in the community. 
He's excited about using his accounting skills to help others maximize their potential and to benefit the world in a meaningful way. After graduation, he looks forward to passing his CPA exam and beginning his career in public accounting. Congratulations, Connor. The Award for Excellence in Business Administration is presented to Dominic Joseph Mattioni. Dominic has engaged in a co-op at Edward Jones for three years when he was able to put his skills and knowledge into real world use. He also enjoyed his role as a manager at the M store. After graduation, Dominic will be taking a summer position at the National Geospatial Intelligence Agency. And this will be while he completes his MBA. The Award for Excellence in Management and Leadership is presented to Camille Samantha Abel. While at Maryville, Camille has served as a peer mentor, Saints Nation leader, and the president of Best Buddies, supporting inclusion for individuals with intellectual and or developmental disabilities. Her summer in Florence, Italy and Lugano, Switzerland was most memorable and invaluable for understanding and appreciating the world. After completing her graduate degree, Camille plans to pursue her career in human resources. The Award for Excellence in Marketing is presented to Andrew Charles Sundet. Drew credits his active role in Maryville Reaches Out as instrumental in helping him to understand empathy and community. He enjoyed the courses and internship at HLK that allowed him to gain real world experience, which provided valuable insight into the business world. Next year, Drew will be completing his MBA with a concentration in data analytics, which he plans to parlay into a marketing analyst or marketing research position. Good evening. The Award for Excellence in Cybersecurity is presented to Andrea Rodriguez. During her Maryville career, Andrea has served in a number of key leadership roles, including peer mentor, Saints Nation leader, Latinx Student Association executive, women in cybersecurity president, and after graduation, Andrea will be pursuing her master's degree in cybersecurity at DePaul University in Chicago. The Award for Excellence in Management Information Systems is presented to Juan Andre Segura. Juan enjoyed his classes and really appreciated that the variety of courses helped him understand what he really likes and enjoys. He is currently looking for a position in information systems in the United States or in his homeland of Colombia. We have co-recipients this year. The Awards for Excellence in Rawlings Sports Business Management are presented first to Adam Paul Aldridge. Adam cites three key, key experiences as instrumental to his learning at, at, Maryville, at, at Maryville. Grassroots Marketing Internship Program at, at Rawlings Sports uh, Sporting Goods, Sp Sports Business in, in London Study Abroad, and creating the St. Louis Blues High School Esports Tournament as part of his Rawlings Sports Management Sponsorship class. He is currently interning at Repsoto, where, where he will begin full-time employment uh, in May as an account certified manager. Our second recipient is Jacob Hayden Anderson. 
Jacob also cites the London Study Abroad Experience and his, inter and his internship at Rawlings Sporting Goods in digital marketing as significant to his Maryville experience. He has been hired uh, on full time in digital marketing in a digital marketing role at Rally House. Morgan Bailey Ripper is our final honoree. Morgan also appreciated the opportunity to study abroad in England. She served as the communications manager for the inaugural Blues Gaming NHL Showdown as part of the sports marketing class and also project coordinator for the first national uh, broadcast of the Musial Awards while interning with the St. Louis Sports Commission. Next year, she will be continuing her education at Maryville, uh, pursuing an MBA with a concentration in marketing and then hopes to pursue a marketing position in the sports marketing industry. I'm pleased to begin the presentation of our Graduate Student Awards. The award for Outstanding Graduate Student in Accounting is presented to Michelle Virginia Workmeister. Michelle served as the event coordinator and treasurer for Connect, was the president for CAPS for Cancer, and also completed four internships in accounting. She has accepted a position as a staff accountant at Brown Smith Wallace in their entrepreneurial services group and also plans to sit for the CPA exam. Congratulations, Michelle. The Rebecca Mann Award for Outstanding MBA Student is presented to Michelle Jean Kaufman. Michelle's most memorable projects at Maryville were in her capstone course with Professor Tim Burke. She is grateful for her meaningful relationships with her professors and her advisor. She plans to continue her supplier management career at the Boeing Company, pursuing leadership roles that will allow her to put into practice the sh skills she gained through her MBA. The award for Outstanding Graduate Student in Management and Leadership is presented to Abigail Louise Stolzer. Abigail agrees that her professors made a great impact on her experience by creating a welcoming environment in her online classes. She appreciated the academic and professional support they offered. After graduation, she plans to continue to grow her career as a marketing professional. The Award for Outstanding Graduate Student in Business Data Analytics is presented to Anthony Brown. Anthony works at Lockheed Martin as a Senior Analytics Manager. He learned a great deal from many courses, but specifically noted the application of predicted modeling in relation to business has allowed him to better impact his company. He also noted the data warehousing and data mining courses were essential to his growth at Lockheed, where he intends to stay and continue growing after earning this degree. Congratulations, Anthony. We have co-recipients for the award for outstanding graduate student in cybersecurity. Our first award is presented to Hiran Anthony Amarsinger. Hiran appreciated the opportunity to form virtual friendships with his classmates. He is a member of the Maryville Cybersecurity Association and has appreciated experiencing and learning from shared resources. He truly enjoyed his pen testing and cyber analysis courses best he plans to continue working as a director of technology at the Child and Family Guidance Center. And our second recipient is Charlene Abigail Dykes. Charlene described her experiences at Maryville as absolutely amazing. 
She found her interactions with fellow students to be incredibly impactful and also enjoyed being part of the Women in Technology and Maryville Cybersecurity Association. After graduation, she plans to pursue a career at the Department of Homeland Security and pursue a PhD. Congrats. The award for outstanding graduate student in software development is presented to Matthew Carrington. Matthew has most appreciated the support and materials provided by his faculty. He enjoyed the challenging and rewarding class projects and plans to continue his career at MasterCard. It is now my honor to present the final two awards of the evening. The Maryville University MBO, stands for Maryville Business Organization, Max Vogel Award goes to a junior or senior with a 3.25 GPA or better who is a commuter stu student and active as a leader in classes on campus or in the community. This year's recipient is Blake Potter. Blake has appreciated the coursework that helped solidify his passion for cybersecurity that led to his first cyber certification, which was Security Plus, and that helped him develop key skills that he will be able to put in practice in the Cyber Fusion Center. He has engaged in this experience twice, where he has had the opportunity to do real-world vulnerability scanning for our local nonprofit clients. He has been instrumental in helping other students learn the skills needed to be successful in these roles as well. After graduation, Blake will be working as a computer forensic examiner for the St. Louis County Police Department. Congratulations, Blake. And finally, the Simon School of Business's highest honor is the recipient of the Dr. Pamela Horwitz Leadership and Civic Engagement Award. This year, we are proud to present this award to Carl Christian Ole Lindoff. As a campus leader, Carl has served as the president of the Maryville Business Organization, where he organized an industry professionals roundtable event that allowed students to talk to these professionals about key business topics. He has also truly appreciated the growth and learning he has gained through his internship experiences at the St. Louis Regional Chamber in Human Resources and Project Management, and on campus at the Abstract Marketing Group. He has been an engaged member of the Maryville community and has been honored to serve as captain of the swim team for two years. After graduation, Carl will be returning to his home in Sweden, where he has accepted the role of Supply Chain Management Coordinator at Stora Enzo, one of the world's largest suppliers of biomaterial packaging. Carl is a lifelong learner and always works to make the world a better place. He feels strongly that Maryville has provided him with the right tools to succeed and advance in his career and in life. Congratulations, Carl. Let us take this opportunity to congratulate all of our award recipients for their outstanding accomplishments. Thank you all for joining us to celebrate our most outstanding students. We know the commencement ceremony will look and feel a little different this year, but please know we are incredibly proud of, our, of all of your accomplishments and celebrate you for all you have already achieved. We look forward to you staying engaged as alumni from Maryville University, and we hope to see you at future alumni events. Congratulations to all of our award recipients and our Delta Mu Delta inductees tonight. Have a great week. <laughs>